Hi friends, how are you guys doing today? I uh, don't know exactly what I'm going to get up to today um, other than not getting ready for the day. <laughs> this is as much as I'm going to get ready. I am going to go walking during Ashley's cheer. Jason has book club tonight, so there's no like, oh, let's be home, you know, by a set time or anything like that. So I'm going to go work out, but I have four hours to kill before I go and do that. And it's rainy and gross outside. So I, I'm leaving tomorrow. You guys finally know when I'm leaving. I'm going on my little trip tomorrow. And let me see if I can find, yes, I need to move the laundry. There's always laundry and it's going to be interesting. I am going to have the laundry caught up. You can see that's a whole stack there. Two loads in there. Hoping, I don't know if I'm going to do the towels. This is going to be interesting. I don't think I'm going to do the towels. I'm going to get as much done as I can. I hope, I'm not going to say exactly how long I'm going to be gone, but I'm going to be gone long enough. They're going to need to do the laundry. This is the towel basket. So clearly I am caught up on towels for them and I don't have any more dirty ones in my bathroom. One, we can see how many towels they actually go through in one week. Okay, but one thing I'm gonna do, see I've got, <laughs> it's like packing central in here. Like it's going to get crazy. That is the Hawaii stuff. I've already started to set that aside. You guys, I'm just gonna tell you, I'm out of breath. <laughs> I had a breath coming up the stairs. I'm just gonna tell you, fair warning, when I get home from this trip, I'm gonna let myself relax, get caught up, edit videos, likely do laundry, but then it'll be full bore packing and prep for Hawaii. It is still snowing in Japan and I have to rethink again, like how can we pack warm clothes and tropical swimsuits and shorts in carry-on bags. And I need to get three more bags. I wanna borrow them because I have no need for three more of those guys. So I'm hoping no one else is going somewhere for spring break because we need them for a month because I, I pack ahead of time, pack ahead of time. That being said, I can't finish packing until tonight after I shower and technically I, I need to like put my makeup on in the morning and I'm gonna straighten my hair so that my hair is done for at least a couple days while I am there. But I, when also when I get home, it's birthday time. And while these two here, actually there's four things here. Those are for Chelsea. Um, I, I can't show you the things for Ashley, Kaylee, Kaylee, Ashley that I just got at Marshall's yesterday. Actually, there's another one in there for Ashley. I'm really excited about the things I found yesterday. Some of the days when you go to Marshall's, you're like, yes, like score. And then other days you're like, I got nothing. I came in here wanting to just shop and a little bit of cash on the side and you don't find anything. Yesterday, I probably went in with not enough cash on hand and I went and bought a head anyway. So, cause I found good things and they were on their list. <sighs> Without, I can't show you that stuff, but I'm gonna leave that there because we also need to go, also, side note, I got these guys from Target. Can you even see that? It's the little space saver bags. Use it with the vacuum, the vacuum. I got one for my wedding dress. I'm gonna get that from my dad's house. And I had to vacuum seal it up, fold it, hopefully, and be able to fit it into my carry-on bag. But I'm also, it's the only like hour chunk of my day where no one is home. Even though it's not Abby's birthday, I don't necessarily want her, I don't know, to know. Cause then she just taunts Kaylee, like mom's put all your birthday presents in her bedroom. She taunts people. I don't think she really cares, but. I do only have a little bit while she's at school. Haley with Jacob. And the kids have half day. I guess Ash, yeah. They all have half day, they're just staggering. Okay. It's, I've got birthday stuff in here. And we put the heaviest boxes on top of it. Um, we put like, this is the pasta bucket. <laughs> so it's got like pasta, pasta boxes and uh, all that kind of stuff. Okay, I put it with food to mask, you know, and hide it. I, we need another shelf. We haven't replaced the shelf that we got rid of. It would be really nice to not have to just stack these guys. So, I gotta put you down. I'm gonna take the whole bucket upstairs and go through everything. I need, I made a list yesterday of everything that I've gotten for the kids for their birthdays, and then it leaves the things that I need to get still, which I might go do today, which is why I'm kind of rushing to get this stuff done. To be back in time for Ashley to go to cheer. Um, she's home in two hours. <sighs> I gotta hurry, I gotta hurry. Sorry for the bad lighting. If Ashley's friends are watching, I will know if you tell Ashley where this spot is. All right, got it. Also, when Jason's watching, remember how I said we're gonna put ski boots somewhere where I don't trip over them. You hear me, Jason, you hear me? I'm glad I checked, because that is the cereal bucket. Okay, where is the birthday stuff? I also will have to get out. This is also why I want another shelf, because I told him this can't be a shelf. This cannot, be. this is all from him. When I need to get into these buckets, that is all our towels. 
leaving it in there for now. But this drives me crazy because I keep like, I keep stuff in here I need to get in. Like paper plates and cups for when people come over and then I don't even know what's in here. Yeah, that's cleaning supplies. I need to be able to get into it. Like this one, I couldn't put it away because skis were probably on top of here. Where, I don't know where it is. Okay, found it, can't show you now. That whole bucket is filled with, I don't know why there's Hershey's in there. Okay, I can't show you anything that I just did. I was quickly going through things because I don't want Ashley to come home. This is a whole bunch of snacks that have been left in my bedroom from other people watching TV up here, which is exactly what I didn't want to happen. But I have sorted the birthday gift, pulled out one Easter gift, and I have some more Easter gifts. I hope are in my car. I'm gonna go get those out because I want to get Easter gifts. I don't do a ton of Easter stuff anyway, but I am gonna do a little something this year just because it is before our trip <laughs> for the first time in a long time. I have taken Easter and even like Valentine's. We've gone in February before. Um, those two holidays have always fallen in the middle of our trip and they aren't this year. So I can actually do that. And um, I also found a whole stash of Snickers bars. I think I know now where Ashley was getting a stash of candy from. I think back when I was filling up stockings for Christmas, there was a leftover bag. Remember that Halloween candy I got from my friend? One, I think she hid these candy bars. This I can't show you, but she found that bag, I think, and doesn't like Snickers, so. <laughs> Now there's a whole bag of Snickers, but they can have the Hershey's bars. They've been making those banana, they call them banana split, I guess. So they can make those, the Hershey's bars. I'm actually just gonna put it out for them. There's no point in saving it for s'mores during the summer. Might as well use these. Um, I also found a thing of chocolate chips in a cupboard that they didn't belong. So I wanted to pull them out. So I think I have, I, I debate, because if I wait until Ashley gets home, I have an hour and 10 minutes until she's home. Um, if I wait until she gets home, I could probably go to the dollar store and find, I need to find more birthday bags. I think I found our Easter bags. I'm not gonna do baskets because of the gifts that I'm giving. You'll see later, I'm doing bags. And I can fold them up and save them for next year. Actually, I'm gonna put this in here, because I think I'm gonna go look in the back of my car for the other Easter things. Jason brought one of the Easter things into the house and set it here on the counter the other day. And I was like, what are you doing? So I could go now and go to the dollar store and get those things, but it's also in the same direction as cheer. And I know if I go now and Ashley comes home, what can we do before we go to cheer? And I've already done that. I don't have anything left. So part of me is like, maybe we leave an hour early and we go to the dollar store and get her a snack before taking her to cheer. And then I go walking. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. I am gonna go out to my car and get the other Easter things that I have so far. And then I think I'm only gonna get, I think I need one more thing for Chelsea. Like, well, one thing thing for Chelsea. You'll see. It's I, it, I didn't plan it this way. I just saw the things at Costco and one thing for Ashley. I thought, oh, that's kind of fun and different. Uh, getting him a thing for Easter, which I'm not like a huge proponent of doing that but it was kind of a cool thing but then um you'll see but then i'm just gonna get like easter candy which i'll get closer to easter i think i'll wait like two weeks or so um there i think we'll still have easter candy in two weeks i think easter is gonna sneak up on people and they're not gonna be as prepared so i think i still have time i think i have an hour to do nothing i think i do um also i did my nails the other day did i show you guys i got this nail polish i don't think i showed you i got this nail polish at marshall's on clearance uh, along with the other birthday stuff so i did my nails i already have one chip which again I do dip I'm excited to maybe try it and see if my nails go to pot if they go to pot they're gonna be bad well they're not gonna be terribly bad if I do it right before our trip to Japan they won't be terribly bad they might get bad in Hawaii which is unfortunate so I'm gonna rest here for a second and wait for Ashley to get home and then we'll decide what to do this one's home and I somehow made it on the couch I don't know how that happened how do, I don't do get a package Ashley's gonna open it. Hopefully it's not good. I wouldn't be letting you open it if it was birthday. Oh, okay. I am working through birthday stuff though. I know it's It's probably a big surprise if it's not birthday presents, what it could be. Fun. Well, I think it's fun. Dad thought it was so fun that he wanted to get one for himself. Dad was actually jealous of something that I got. 
vacuum cube. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. Oh, it's a backpack. It's the same backpack, but it's actually, this one is for Abby. Dad liked it so much, I got one for Dad. And then just the more things that we think that we're going to need to take with us. Because we realize how much I need. Well, I'm going to take up like, probably a whole suit. She's going to take up, yeah, she has to take one or two sets of pom poms. So we got it just in case. Like, well, we'll see about that. Know. We'll see how much it fit. But we got another one of those backpacks. I can't remember if this set comes with packing cubes. I don't think the black ones did. Um, they're cheaper. But okay. Um, did you like my plan? Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't think we need to leave until like one to fifty-six. So two o'clock. So maybe leave closer to three. Yeah. Does that work? Is that another one of the sweatshirts Kaylee gave you? Did you like it when she went through her closet? You got quite a few shirts, didn't you? She likes baggy sweatshirts, and these are all older. Like, Kaylee's had these ones for a long time. So they're nice and big and baggy for her, but they're not, like, too bad. Hold, stand up. Let me see the one you have on. It's perfect for you. Cool. Okay, we are at the dollar store. We we're trying to decide between Ashley's birthday bags. These ones, they're cute. We've done a cute before. Then we saw this one, gold and silver with this kind of Hawaiian print, which they have said, to be fair, you've said you didn't want to do Hawaiian prints. Your shirt is inside out. Mm -mm. You always wear your clothes inside out. Oh, she's in the car. <laughs> okay, and you're freezing because we didn't think we were going to stop here. You want that one? Usually it's a surprise, but I wanted her to pick out. You want that one? Okay. We'll get that. Okay, Ashley's gone into practice. We ran into a friend of hers from <laughs> camp, from cheer, while we were in the dollar store. All right, I am going to leave this bag in the car, as I do. Um, I changed my watch band put it in there, and I put on my sweat one, my pink one. You see that one, bright pink, because my wrist gets nice and sweaty. But I want that other one to wear tomorrow. I'm not even gonna carry the case for my headphones. I am starting out my walking tonight with not even a mile on my belt. I've done nothing today, so. I'm not going to challenge myself to a certain number of miles. I'm just going to try and at least walk for two hours. We're going to try and walk until six o'clock. Um, and then I'll go home and shower and relax, get dinner. Um, and then come back and get her later on tonight. Uh, Jason, like I said earlier, he has book club tonight, so he won't be home till late. So, um, okay, let's go ahead. All right. I'm not done walking yet. I should probably pause my little work out here. Nope. Pause. I think I'm on mile three. I accidentally turned it off when I went to the bathroom, but the so three and a half I've done. I'm going to go back in, but <laughs> when your phone is your key and you hit 19% because I'm listening to a podcast and playing solitaire at the same time, <laughs> I'm going to lose battery very fast. I'm not going to be able to get home. And Jason is not anywhere near. Kaylee is, but she wouldn't be able to bring me a well Jason would be able to like whatever I don't want to deal with it so I'm gonna sit in my car here for a second take a breather I've got water in here as well I've got one left in there too but but I did notice something um when I found my silicone rings that I'm gonna to take to Hawaii with me so don't worry about my wedding ring but um <laughs> let me scoop my seat back here I was walking and I was probably like an hour in and uh I don't know why I was thinking about well, I'm thinking about what I'm going to pack and take tomorrow on my trip. And I thought, oh, I wonder if I should wear my tennis shoes or if I should even take them. Because I wore some different shoes yesterday and I was like, oh, those ones are kind of comfortable. Maybe I could just get away with taking those. But it, anyway, so I was thinking about shoes and I looked down at my feet. <laughs> and actually, when I looked down, this is what I saw. So it's not that big of a difference. They're, they're the same shoe ultimately. But then I turned my feet to the side and I was like, these are two different shoes. <laughs> Insane. I put on two different shoes. They literally feel the same. They're, I'm assuming that's New Balance logo. Yeah. I'm betting they're the exact same shoe in two different colors. And luckily they're both black and no one's really paying attention to people's feet. But I wore two different shoes to the gym. So that's lovely. Oh, heaven help me. So I'm just gonna hydrate up, let my phone charge here, and then I have a friend that's in there. She's doing the elliptical, and then she's gonna work on her arms for a minute, and then we're gonna walk more. We did this about two, three weeks ago, and I haven't see seen her. I mean, she comes regularly. I haven't been coming regularly. So I'm gonna go back in there with her because she can't stay past six o'clock. So I only have like a half hour to get back in there with her. So I'm gonna charge up and then go back in. I'm probably gonna walk past six o'clock myself just because I'm feeling good and I'm feeling like I can. I don't have any time limits. So if I walk clear until seven o'clock, I might just sit in here and wait in the car until Ashley is done. Um, so oh, I see some crackers. Maybe I could have some crackers. It was fun to have Ashley pick out these um, 
my friend is texting me. Um, it's part of why my battery dropped down. It was fun to pick these up with Ashley. I have a whole other set of bags that I'm going to use for, for Chelsea. And then Kaylee's gifts, it's a whole package deal t together. So hers, her gift is going to be completely different. None of her st stuff is going to go into gift bags like that. It's going to get wrapped a whole different way. Um, so I've got that checked off my list. I know what gifts I have for each kid. I know what I need to buy left. I only have one thing left for Ashley. And then I have snacks for all of them to get. They always get like their snack of choice, like their, what do you call it? Their um, sour gummies or Kaylee's chocolate and caramel. Um, I always get them their little snack that they like. Um, and I told Chelsea yesterday, she's like, I was kind of getting worried that you weren't asking more about my birthday list. And I said, no, I just need to wait and to be, to be on a different credit card card statement <laughs> until I start buying your Christmas, your birthday gifts. I did buy some of her stuff because I was doing an order and so I needed to like just get it done with but um she was like okay that's what I was kind of hoping because like I wasn't asking for expensive things but I don't want you to be overwhelmed because like you have Kaylee and Abby's birthday not Kaylee and Abby Kaylee and Ashley's birthday and then the trip and then Hawaii like she's like that's kind of a lot to have on your budget and I was like child thank you so much for like I don't I don't like that she had to have that stress on her and worry about me being able to get her birthday presents, but I was appreciative that she was sensitive to that fact. Um, so that was very thoughtful of her. And I said, I will have just over a week. Eh, I'm not going to tell you exactly how many days I have after we get back from Hawaii. But the nice thing is with Amazon, I can order things from Amazon, which half of her list is from Amazon. I can order those things from Hawaii as I'm like laying in bed at night. Um, cause again, that will be on a new credit card statement. I'm just kind of floating out, um, these expenses to the future so that I can afford them as we go along. So it's just what you got to do when you have kids and you want to give them what they want. You just kind of have to trickle. It's like the birthday trickle. <laughs> got to be able to afford it when you can. It's so hot in here. Yeah, I got kind of warm because I was cold. I stayed here instead of going home. Um, what is this down here? A trophy? Or is that just like the megaphone? Uh, no, it's a trophy because Red Squad at the end, we all like, I forgot to bring my other one. So I have two now. Okay. Except I'm gonna bring out Friday. Okay. Yeah. Alright. Well that's kinda cool. I'm close to getting it back into I can I'm close it, to I'm getting it. Cheese. I have it on cheese. I don't All know right. where to put Let's this. go home. Well, I just pulled in and her neighbor was sitting outside in her garage and she had all these black bags. And I was like, Oh, do you have donations for us? And then I instantly saw her like slicked back hair and I was like, no. And she was like, mm-hmm. I just spent five hours at Lice knowing you. <laughs> Luckily, you don't have any contact with her daughter. Luckily. Yeah, but now it's giving me they, like the, oh, you're I know. Itches. Luckily, they did not go to cheer tonight. She is on Ashley's yeah, and cheer I squad. Them. I helped them with their cartwheels. <laughs> Luckily, she took them because, oh, now I'm itchy. Yeah, My now night could have been. Itchy. We could have had a way worse night. Anyway, they went and got checked out and you pay 20 bucks to get checked and then it's like literally like $200 a person to get done. Um, oh, that's good. I, okay, go put them in the freezer. I was worried about that. I didn't realize I had her seat turned on the whole time I was sitting there waiting for like an hour that her seat was on and I had a bet that bag of snickers <laughs> down on the floor. I totally forgot, which is a good thing because then I didn't eat it. Anyway, so my friend has spent five hours at last knowing you, but luckily she went and got him checked out instead of having her go to cheer because she was able to maintain the you know the contact to just the well, four families because then I would, our whole cheer team right the whole cheer team would 160 been, people oh no I'm luckily yeah, now I'm just they like, maintained the contact to all the only people that went to their midwinter break getaway <laughs> they had like four families that went and rented a place and all stayed together kids all bunked together which is why all the kids have it so Anyway, but now I'm glad to know when I get the life update paper from the school tomorrow, we'll know where the out outbreak is from, and I no don't really have any worry of her getting it. Um, yeah, I'm still gonna be like, I know, but it's also a weekend. All right, back at home, this is no longer like an empty suitcase. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I have my makeup bag to put in tomorrow morning. Yeah, Got shoes to take. You can get I can't show her. She's cream. not. You don't need ice cream tonight. Please. Well, then you call him. Yeah, it's not yeah, my yeah, yeah. I know he will I've got this bag here my little cinch bag and then I have all this <laughs> I don't know I'm I don't know that I I don't know I don't know if I can go without I still need to like live life 
<laughs> and like be a mom and have access to my notebook and then I still want to edit and get footage taken care of in the case that like something gets lost or damaged I have a fear of like losing footage so and this is more electronic stuff than I thought I was gonna have and <laughs> that is for my well it's for this bag but I don't want all of this loosey-goosey in here so I'm kind of considering making a little electronic bag this is like my power cord for my laptop. This is the external cord and the two cord, the external power pack and two cords, my external drive and attachment and two camera batteries. And that is for this guy. And then that's my SD transfer card and my battery charger. So what I might do is actually utilize, let's see if I can actually use this guy. I just don't wanna like try and figure out another pouch. Let me see if I can make this all fit in here. Okay, this is all stuff that I technically use for editing. That's nice that that's kind of separate because I don't necessarily need most of this unless I'm editing, but I want to have this guy handy for the plane and the airport. So that stuff needs to kind of go here. So I'm kind of taking this stuff out. Lotion, perfume, is that all? Okay, this isn't bad. Those I want to have easier access to along with that. Took that out. Okay, I think we're not too bad here. I think if all of this goes into this bag, that's easy to get to. I also need my chapstick ball, which I use this at night. So will I remember? <laughs> I literally use this all night long. Okay, I'm just gonna have to set it out because I also need this charging cord. I'm, gonna, I'm trying to like get everything charged before I go to bed so I can actually pack that. Okay, so I think we're good. All right, I'm gonna admit what I look like right now. Showered. Um, I need to dry my hair. Not, I'm not, I don't think I'm gonna straighten it tonight, but I need to dry it tonight so it's mostly straight. And then I need to put my camera away. This bag is heavy. Um, giving me ideas of how I need to pack this for our trip to Japan. And this one I've gotten more empty because I think I'm not gonna take my tennis shoes. These are the shoes I'm gonna wear during the week. And then I have the sandals for church on Sunday. I'm actually second guessing going to church, but I know my dad would like me to go if he's able to go. I think I'll wear these in the airport. I need more space to come home with stuff in this one. I'm just, I'm getting concerned about that. I do have my uh, crossbody in here and my Pringles, which will, the Pringles will be gone but it does give me great pause. I'm fine going there, and if I can't fit everything in, I'll just leave it with my twin sister. It's not the end of the world. We will be making a drive out there eventually, and I can get stuff in the car. But it is giving me pause. Guys, get, um, well, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do pills differently um, on the Japan trip and Hawaii trip, but I just have two medications for this trip. But I remembered as I was kind of going through these that I bought this. Do you guys remember when I bought that? Bought it with Jason at the, I don't remember what, what store. It was a pretty iconic store. I can't remember, he would know. But I think for Japan and Hawaii, I am not gonna be able to pack this guy. I don't think so. And I don't do my makeup in Hawaii. I'm gonna do minimal makeup when we're in Japan, especially if it's cold and rainy. Being in the rain and having makeup on is the worst. But I also wanna be a little bit more presentable. I'm just gonna minimize it a ton. All of this is just prepping me to be able to live out of these two suitcases. So I think I'm gonna minimize and go to this level when I, I'm just leaving it in here because it doesn't take up any space, but I'm gonna go very minimal for our next trip. I was thinking about just doing that for this one and not having this big thing in here, but I'm bumping from house to house like every night. <laughs> and I found out my twin sister's roommate accidentally double booked their spare room. <laughs> So I am bunking it with my twin sister, which is totally fine. We are accustomed to doing that. It's it's a twin thing, I guess. I am not I'm not opposed to sharing a bed with her. I think the sh the space in this bag needs to be condensed so that I can fit my wedding dress in this whole side here. I'm gonna take my dreading wedding dress and either fold it up and put it in that space saver bag, or I'm gonna lay it flat in that space saver bag and then take all the air out of it so that I can then fold it in three or four you know folds and really kind of get it into that space there and then the shoes can go to that side and then hopefully I can get like a yearbook or two. They're just the elementary ones, I think. And then I don't remember <sighs> high school ones. They're thicker, but I just can't visualize that they're in there. You know what I mean? Like I can't visualize what's in that memory box of mine at home. But I think that's, that's the best I can do for this trip. I'm gonna sign off with you so that I can do my hair. Well, just dry it. And then I, can, I can't really do anything else tonight. So I think we're gonna call it a night and get into bed early. I don't have to get up terribly early tomorrow, but I need to be ready to go. So I'm gonna take care, or you guys take care and we'll see you guys next time.